put y'all calling me Juice World with this haircut. I mean, I don't take it as an insult, but like. Yo, yo, yo! Ah! Bro, I'm so excited because I have some Itachi grip tape from Rika Yushi. Ooh, that looks so badass. Straight Yo, I'm finna set this up, bro. I don't even have a new board to set it up with, so I'm gonna take off grip tape from an old board, hook it up. The black Goku grip tape is kind of dirty right what now. Is it's that? still good, still holding up. I can't wait to skate this and have it look fresh. Make my shit straight, bitch ass nigga. It might just be tripod clips. And another thing, so this is kind of recent news. Bam Marger was out here on vacation just skating. Delray Beach is um, 505 Teen Center Hobbit Skate Park. And my friend Darius, as you guys know, he works there. So he actually witnessed Bam Margera break his arm in the mini ramp, which was crazy, dude. They actually filmed it. My friend Octavio actually had the footage. Bro, TMZ actually bought out the rights to his video. So because of TMZ bought the video and copyrighted the clip, I can't show the clip just in my video. So this is how we're doing it, avoiding the copyright claim. Igza. Bam Margera. I feel bad because he was probably just on vacation, just passing through, trying to inspire the youth at the teen center. He's probably done that trick a million times. And then this one time where maybe you don't skate every single day, you just have overconfidence and then your body is not as warm to the movements that you need to make. And so your reflexes, you're not able to catch yourself as you fall. And I think that's what happened. That's my diagnosis. The trick he was trying was a pop shove at no stall revert. I thought it'd be dope to like learn that trick inspired by bam in like a homage paying like homage because i'm sure he could like do that trick all the all day you know that's like a that's like a go-to trick for him it's probably just going to be titled anime grip tape but i'm doing this for bam so i'm watching this in playback right now and i'm really fixated on the lights in my pc bro i'm easily entertained and yo, what's up with y'all calling me juice world with this haircut i mean i don't take it as an insult but like i just can't have blonde tips I'm, I'm happy my hair is growing like my whole roots are all black so it's really starting to be tips now and not just the whole thing I'm feeling great though I'm posting on YouTube my Instagram's up TikTok's up YouTube we could be doing a little better but I'm not focused on the numbers I just want to be consistent and so I'm bringing y'all this video right here make my shit straight bitch ass nigga I'm not gonna show you a close up of this. I definitely messed it up. It's not that bad. It's like, no, I, I messed it up. Pretty bad. Old grip. Yo, yo, yo! Ah! New grip. Again, I'm not gonna show you up close because I did a poor job around the edges. So I'm just gonna skate and then maybe show you a close up while I'm skating. A lot of the veterans on my channel will know that I'm very attached to my hair, just hair in general, not this hairstyle particularly. My hair is like one way that I definitely, for sure, for sure, I'm gonna express myself. And so I have the blonde tips. I might dye it a color. I have, I have thoughts in mind. If my hair looks very stiff, there's a reason. In the past, when my hair gets wet from skating, slightly damped anything the twist will come undone so to prevent that i used an extra strong holding gel so that doesn't happen in the middle of the session and i can just keep skating and doing it with style let's go I have the wrist guard on because i'm not about to injure myself oh say less <laughs> very humid out the skies are very cloudy so i want to get this done before this, it starts raining because last thing i want is for the mini ramp to get wet and then i slip and the same thing happens to me it was bam's right arm and it would definitely be my right arm but knock on wood gotta find some wood confidence pop shove it no stall maybe i'll do that first and then pop shove it no stall with the revert um, so I just watched a keynote with Jeff Bezos and regardless of how you feel about him, one thing he said was if I was starting over giving advice to young people, he suggested you pick a passion because you'll never be great at anything that you don't love. 
and I agree with that. One thing he struck me with was that um, a lot of people get confused by the things they were gifted, right? But the gifts that you have, they're not the thing that constructs your life. It's your choices that construct your life. So you got to be making great choices with those gifts that you have. And that's what will navigate you on your pathway and assure your likelihood to being successful in life. So every time I land on my palm, my left palm specifically, my hand kind of like goes numb for a little bit. It just travels up to my pinky. Like this whole side just kind of goes numb for a little bit. I just got to shake it off. It literally feels like TV static. It's not solely on your gifts. It's about your choices. So if you can just um, stand guard to your choices that you make in life, it doesn't matter about how good you are at the gifts because that's not the thing that constructs your life. So there's still huge opportunity for anybody just based on the choices that you make. Super powerful for me to hear, especially at this point in time in my life. That half cap to no saw, that was new. Like I did that at Mod 11, and this was the second time I actually did that. I think I'm warm enough to try the Pop Shove and Nose Stall. just telling y'all about the TV static when my hand goes numb. I got greedy. I was trying to do two to make it true, but I guess that counts. Just commit, don't slide out. I think I got it. Just gotta keep my weight over it and then pull it. Gotta make sure I get into the nose slow first. Extra risky, do it without the wrist guard. Something is telling me that I shouldn't do this, but confidence. I was leaving the skate park. I didn't even make it to my car yet. And I just had to lay down for like two minutes. Already got a big puddle over here. Bro, I swear I, I just blacked out. Especially cause I haven't slept. I've been up since 6 PM. It's about 12 o'clock right now. So I stayed up all night and then went skating. Like, comment, subscribe. And uh, I'll be doing more of these videos. Maybe I should get more into mini ramp. So let me know in the comments if I should keep doing mini ramp tricks. All right, I'm out.